Let's get into some more Madonna. This is the Virgin Tour from 1985, and the song is. Am I gonna know it? Says everybody. Have I heard this song? No. I know you can wait. boombox on the floor i've just noticed that there's a, there's a boombox that do you know they never brought them back right you, you don't see like kids walking around with them anymore you used to have them on their shoulders and whatever walking up the street it's not something you see it's like that period that time period is just it's gone man it's bad. anyway i'm talking over it notes where's the song been all my life it's another one of these madonna songs and it's like it's catchy it's poppy you know and this really hits a lot of the the good notes for me i i do like them kind of songs a lot of people criticize me for that in the comments i do get a lot of criticism for liking the the poppy side of madonna and and people say i don't really understand like the darker side or the more uh <laughs> you know uh dirtier side of uh madonna but i just haven't heard it enough i don't think you know give me time i'm i'm settling into being a madonna fan <laughs> We got a booty shot. <laughs> Is this the same cameraman who, who does all Dave Gans, uh, you know, uh, butt shots? The Pash mode, man. I'm, I'm obsessed with. Him. <laughs> but I, 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 it's like whenever he does like the hip thrusts and stuff, you know, when he's he's humping the audience, uh, it, it's just the camera always zooms in on his butt, and and <laughs> I just had to mention it because. Uh, I mean, I I do I do kind of prefer Ma Madonna's butt. I, I mean, if that's a thing, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I like butts. I can't lie. And wow, what a box. Boom box. I what what did I what? What was she doing to that boom box? Up 
So much charisma. I've just noticed, like it, like well, I I did kind of notice in the blonde ambition tour, like, but she really isn't afraid of like being in front of the crowd, and she plays the crowd like real well as well. Like she talks to the crowd, she's constantly talking to the crowd, right? And it's like it's almost like a play. Her concerts are unlike anything I've ever seen before in that sense that she in, she interacts with the crowd quite a lot it, like for example like Michael Jackson he will uh, on particular songs walk into the crowd a little like or, or get uh, the old woman or w whatever uh, up onto the stage and then he'll like dance with them or whatever or sing to them right but with this one it is like a play it's almost like a pantomime actually just wanted to point that out like song actually it's very catchy bit re on the spot repetitive the good song on the, nonetheless uh, this is the kind of stuff that I, I just put on you know if, if I really just want to cheer myself up this is the sort of song that I'd put on because it's very poppy it's very up and jivey it's the sort of thing you could probably like jog down the road it's like it's like one of them exercise songs in fact it's like uh, like I don't know it, it just makes you want to move right <laughs> what do you guys think about this song and also um, I'm pretty sure right that it's like uh, if you think about you know all the costume changes and the little bits that she's adding in she adds in all them like little costume changes between each song and I'm not entirely sure how she's doing it because the camera keeps cutting away I'm not sure if there is an actual cut in between each of these songs but it's like in this one she had like a fedora I, I believe of some kind quite cool right um yeah yeah really enjoyed this this was great that was a banger <laughs> 